I think it would be um, misleading to just to think of Peter as a, a painter, a conscientious painter, and a diligent painter of, of nature. There's no, there's no, um, no photographs, no, no drawings that relate to any of these. Uh, I think probably imagined places. The image really comes from the act of making. Um, this doesn't mean that they're, they're somehow magic onto the canvas, but that perhaps even he doesn't, uh, is not clear to him while he's making it, but when he stops, the, the, the painting has reached uh, a point where it, it is metaphorically weighted to uh, represent something that is beyond simply the description of the scene. Or the, whatever it is, the weather, the conditions of water, it's, uh, uh, and uh, and I think that they, these are intensified. I think by, by through this practice. If he was working directly from drawings and. Um, and photographs, I think perhaps they wouldn't carry the, the weighting that he desires in, in the work. He's describing something that really is to do with feeling, the conditions of um, of human experience that goes beyond simply describing the appearance of things. Uh, but I, I think that in this sense they are quite profound. <laughs>